Hello and welcome to another KC Coding Tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how you can uh, set up some access restrictions on your Linksys router so you can make a schedule on it. This is uh, kind of nice so that if uh, you have kids and you don't want them on the internet between certain hours, you can set this up so that uh, the internet turns off between like something like midnight and 6 in the morning. Now, I think this is a really good idea compared to some other solutions. Uh, personally, I've seen parents take their routers, make a big wooden box around it with a lock on it, then inside the box had a power cord with a um, timer on it, and then plug their router into that, just so that their kids couldn't have access to the internet after midnight. That's a whole lot of work, and this is a whole lot easier. So uh, I'm just going to show you how to do this. First thing you want to do is log into 192.168.1.1 and uh, you're going to put in your password for your Linksys router. By the way, this is only going to work on a Linksys router. So now what you want to do is uh, you're going to be at the setup menu and so you want to go over to access restrictions by clicking on the right here. Now what you want to do is give this uh, a name. So we'll call this uh, schedule. Anyone else have trouble pronouncing that? And now we're going to need to uh, set this to be enabled so that it works. And we're going to uh, edit the list of PCs that this applies to. So um, now you can either change individual IP addresses, which won't work very well because uh, anyone can just uh, release or uh, renew their IP address to get a uh, IP address that isn't uh, on this list. So uh, one thing you can do is if you know how to, you can get the MAC address of that PC because MAC addresses are hard coded and can't be changed. Or if uh, you don't care, um, if you don't care about having access after midnight when your kids don't have it, then you can just make it so that all of the IP addresses are blocked. So I'm just going to set that up. So what you want to do is uh, under IP address range, you want to go from um, number two all the way to 254. Now that'll block all of the available IP addresses because your, your IP addresses can only go from 2 to 254. So you're going to click Save Settings and then you're going to close this window. Next step is to click Allow to allow, uh, or sorry, deny, to deny internet access within the hours that we specify. So you're going to click on Every Day to turn it off and you're going to pick on what days this is going to be on. So I think it'd be smart to do this on Monday. Monday morning, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday morning. And we'll set it up so that it starts at 12 a.m., so right at midnight, and the internet will turn back on at uh, 6. So now what will happen is that on Sunday night, going into Monday morning, it will turn off the internet until 6 a.m., and it'll do that every single weekday. Now, you might want to, nah, you know, we'll, we'll take off Friday so that they can do stuff on Friday. Or no, no, let's just leave it. So anyways, now uh, what you want to do in the end is you want to go to uh, Save Settings and click Continue. Now uh, you just want to go through and check and make sure all the settings are the same. You want to make sure that you have the name still there, that it's enabled. You want to check the, uh, check the IP address settings that you set up. Check that the hours that you put in are still the same. And if they're all the same, you should be good to go. So uh, now if it's between this range of time, then uh, you're won't be able to access the internet on any of the machines connected to this network. So uh, hopefully that works for you, and um, this has been Casey for Casey Coding, and I'm logging off.